road sales. Today I want to show you around this 2011 Monterey 204 FS Bowrider uh, wakeboard edition. It's fitted with a Mercruiser 4.3 litre MPI 220 horsepower steering drive engine. Comes completely with a factory wakeboard package with factory wakeboard graphics, factory wakeboard tyre. It has a twin axle UK spec roller coaster road trailer. Um, it's a two owner boat from new and it currently has 215 hours on the clock. It's a beautiful condition. I last sold this boat to her current owner in January 2018, so just about a year ago. And um, back then it was a stock boat, so we were um, we were selling it as a stock boat of ours. It had only one owner before that, and it had 140 hours on the clock. Um, so the current owner bought it then in January. He has used it for the sea for a season. He's actually put 75 hours on it over the course of the 2018 season. We had a cracking summer. He got a lot of use out of it in Fermanagh. Um, in Northern Ireland, so it's only been in fresh water. So it's only ever, prior to the first owner, only ever used it in fresh water as well. So it's been exclusively used in fresh water. Because we did a, I did a big long, like a half hour long video back in January 2018, which is only a year ago, the boat hasn't really changed since then. So rather than doing another big long video, I'm just gonna do like a sort of a highlight video now, show you the couple of wee things that are, that are different on it. Uh, and then you can watch the full length video from last year. Just disregard anything I'm saying about it being a stock boat. It's not a stock boat. This is a brokerage sale. Now we're selling it on behalf of the current owner. So it's not a stock boat and we don't, we're not selling it with one of our in-house warranties. But apart from that, the boat's in the same condition. He looked after it very well. He only ever launched and recovered it as well. He wasn't happy uh, leaving it in the water. So he put it in um, like on a Saturday morning, take it out on Sunday evening. He, he had a holiday home in Fermanagh. Um, but due to a change in circumstances now, he won't be able to use the boat um, in the foreseeable future. So that's why he's decided to sell it while it's still looking sort of as good as it did whenever he bought it. So the boat basically is in the same condition as whenever he got it in January 18. It's just instead of having 140 hours on the clock, it's got 215 hours on the clock. And it's also about five grand cheaper. So uh, I think it's a really good value package considering this thing is 2011. So it's really fresh and it's fresh water only, and it's in such nice condition. So we'll take a wee quick walk around for the highlight tour now, and then you can, if you're interested, you can sign up for the VIP access and watch the full length video from last year. So there's a really high end finish on the boat. It's um, got these uh, chrome dock lights, or chrome surrounds on these dock lights, set into the big wide band red uh, gel coat, hull color band stripes. So it's a really striking boat with a red gel coat, the red covers and stuff. We got stainless steel pop-up cleats all the way around her. We've got this Monterey sort of water sports graphics pack. We got the Monterey badge, raised chrome Monterey lettering. The gel coat is immaculate all the way down the port side of the boat. There, We've got this pop-up stainless steel, steel cleat back here, and coming right the way back to the corner as well. The actual hull side corner is perfect. The corner of the extended swim platform is immaculate as well. So really smart looking uh, finish to the gel. The whole thing is in immaculate condition. The nose of the boat hasn't uh, suffered from the boat being launched and recovered all season. There's no scratches or damage or anything, so it shows you again how careful the owner was. Um, and then take a look down along the starboard side of the boat. It's also in immaculate condition. A wee bit of scuffing on this uh, sticker here, but this was in it um, whenever we sold it there last year, so the owner didn't do that. So he hasn't put any, he hasn't put a single mark on the exterior of the boat. The hull's still perfect. Um, all this pop-up cleats and everything. Monterey buys is the corner back here. There's no impact damage, there's no scuffs or scrapes. Um, the whole thing looks really smart. So being the wakeboard edition, um, this boat obviously has the factory wakeboard tower, but it also has this extended swim platform too. So you've got like this two-tiered swim platform arrangement um, where you can sit up on the upper platform, put your skis on, wakeboards on, stuff like that. Um, the owner did a lot of water sports with his kids and things this summer. Boat's fantastic, it's really well set up for, for doing wakeboarding, pulling rubber rings, water skiing, all that sort of stuff. Uh, and everything back here is also in lovely condition. This boat is 21 foot 8 inches overall length and it's 8 foot 4 inches wide. So it's a big bow rider, there's a lot of room in it. It's ready to carry 7 passengers plus gear. Um, the seats are nice and a low set, you've got great protection. From the, uh, from the wraparound windscreen. Um, you're seating in the cockpit here for, 
five or six adults, you fit four across the, the bench seat at the back, no problem. You've got two bucket style uh, helm and passenger seats up front, and you get seating for another two or three people in the, the bow area um, also. One of the clever things like, I like about it is this walkthrough transom, so you can lift these seat cushions out um, on the starboard side, and you get a full walkthrough transom. This is all molded and on skid, so it's easy to climb, you walk in and out of the boat. Um, without climbing over the seats, it also means that um, you can, if you're you know swimming off the boat or doing water sports, you don't have to clamber over the top of the cushions all the time. Um, this condition wise, this thing is virtually as good as it was in January 18, whenever we sold the boat. Um, whenever we sold it back then, the thing was like brand new. There was no marks on it. There was everything was perfect. It's pretty much like that bar two wee minor defects and I mean these are super minor but I don't like people to travel and be disappointed whenever they get here so I can point out everything up front. So we have one wee sort of rub in this cushion back here. It's not torn or anything but it's just sort of been pushed and gathered up a wee bit there. Um, it's not actually through the material. I would say it's happened from maybe somebody sliding a wakeboard or set of skis over that. And then the other one is just here on this corner where the stitching has just slightly separated. And that's just a, a bit of wear and tear. Um, again, it's a wee bit unfortunate, but it's not that bad. Um, and it is what it is in a water sports boat. If it's being used with skis and stuff, maybe somebody kneeling there to pass a board over the back, then that, that sort of thing can happen. But that's literally the only two defects that I can find anywhere in the boat. Um, and other than that, she is exactly as she left us back in January last year. Um, so that's you know, and that that's pretty impressive. There's no there's no scuffs in the hull. There's no other damage around her. She's spick and she, you know, she's really clean and tidy, spotless. So you can tell that the current owner has really looked after. it. He's had a bit of fun out of it, obviously, um, but he's he's looked after it well too. And it's nice to see the thing getting used. And a boat that has been has been regularly used and well used and properly looked after is also tends to be a more reliable boat. So you can buy this thing going into the 2019 season, knowing that it's just turn key and go. There's nice straightforward engine access. Just flip up this hatch, lifts on two gas struts, and gives you good service access around this Mercruiser 4.3 MPA. So that's a multi-point fuel injection engine. It um, makes 220 horsepower, matched up that Alpha 1 leg, makes the boat jump up on plane quickly. It's good for like 50 miles an hour flat out. Really strong performing boat. We, have it, we had it fully serviced, and inspected before it went to the current owner in, in January 18. It's running real sweet. He's no issues with it at all. It has been drained down and winterized. Um, it maybe could be could do with a wee service before you, you use it again in, uh, for the 2019 season. But the oil level is good. The oil is pretty clean as well. She hasn't used any oil at all. Gearbox oil level is good and stuff. Um, so the thing has been obviously had 75 hours put on it last year. She's running really nice and the engine bay is still as clean as it was whenever the boat left us in January 18. There's a really nice helm position on the boat. Um, you've got a fully adjustable helm seat, five position tilt adjust on the steering wheel. You've got full range of Monterey Marine instruments. Just key on here and show you the current engine hours, which are 215.8 hours. Everything is still working um, exactly as it should. All the gauges are working, all your switch gear, Navigation lights, dock lights, cockpit lights, engine blower, bilge pump, horn, and you get your digital depth sounder over here as well. So, um, really nice, smart looking dash, great visibility, good command and helm position. For if, if you're driving the boat more enthusiastically, it's easy to keep control of it. Um, and everything is um, just as it was back in January 18. It's a really perfect boat. Everything looks good, working well. One thing the owner did do this year was upgrade the stereo. So it's got a brand new JVC Bluetooth stereo. So um, that's handy because it means you can play tunes from your iPhone or from your iPod or iPad. You've also got a wee USB uh, plug-in port so you can charge something off that USB port or play your tunes through it and you've got an auxiliary input too with a wee headphone jack. So brand spanking new JVC stereo. Um, it's bang up to date and uh, we're obviously working perfectly. We have this centre opening windscreen section and this little left out bow door that uh, screens off the, the bow of the boat, so it stops any wind blowing through. Um, and then with this open you get access out into this bow area. It's quite a decent sized bow area. Seats are low set, well upholstered, 
plenty of hand rails here, big stainless steel grab rails. So there you go, that's just a wee quick update on how this boat is looking now in January 2019, a year after we previously sold it. I hope you can agree, the current owner has obviously taken really good care of it. Um, he has had a bit of use out of it during the 2018 season, he's put an extra 75 hours in the clock. But other than that, the boat's as it was. It's running really sweet, um, still has never been anti the, the, the whole bottom hasn't been painted, the trailer's still in great condition, it's only been in and, in and out of fresh water. He has upgraded that stereo to a, a brand new Bluetooth unit as well, which is handy. Um, and the boat looks every bit as good as it did back in 2018. It is for sale now very seriously. The owner's keen to move it on. Um, we've got it on at a very competitive asking price, I think. Substantially less than what he paid for it. And um, if you're interested in the boat, I would encourage you to check out the videos from last year. So if you move, just scroll further down the page, you'll see the, the, the preview video and the full length video from last year. If you sign, it, sign up for VIP access, you can get access to all that information. How to do that is pop your name and email address into the box below this video on our site at GulfstreamBoatSales.com and you can get VIP access which is completely free. Once you've signed in then navigate back to the Monterey 204 page and you can watch that full length video tour from last year. It's a half hour long, shows you, you can check out all the water test footage of the boat um, and just get a much better idea of the sort of features inside it, what the boat's all about and it hopefully will help you to figure out whether it might be the right one for you. Thank you very much for taking the time to watch the video. If you're interested in the boat, uh, sign up for VIP access first and then give me a call or drop me an email to sales at Thank you very much for taking the time to watch the video.